Mastering Internal Audit Organizations neglect implementing audit recommendations, sacrificing operational excellence. What process does the organization have in place for systematically tracking and monitoring the implementation of its internal audit recommendations, particularly those focused on achieving operational excellence, and how are its respective departments and units held accountable for their timely and effective execution? The organization has a robust process in place for systematically tracking and monitoring the implementation of its internal audit recommendations, particularly those focused on achieving operational excellence. This process ensures that all internal audit recommendations are properly monitored, and their implementation is effectively tracked to ensure that the intended benefits are realized. The process begins with the internal audit department, which is responsible for conducting regular audits to identify areas for improvement within the organization. Upon completion of an audit, the internal audit department will issue a report that outlines the findings, recommendations, and the risks associated with not implementing those recommendations. The report is then presented to management, who is responsible for reviewing the recommendations and implementing corrective actions. Management is required to respond to each recommendation, indicating the actions they plan to take to address the findings and the timeline for implementation. Once management has responded to the recommendations, the internal audit department will track the progress of implementation through a dedicated tracking system. This system is used to monitor the status of each recommendation, including the original recommendation, the management response, the implementation status, and any associated risks. The tracking system is updated regularly by the internal audit department, and progress reports are prepared for senior management and the audit committee. These reports highlight the status of each recommendation, identify any delays or roadblocks, and provide an overview of the overall implementation progress. To ensure accountability, each department and unit is assigned an implementation owner who is responsible for overseeing the implementation of the recommendations. The implementation owner is responsible for ensuring that the recommended actions are completed within the agreed-upon timeline and that the benefits of the implementation are realized. Regular meetings are held between the internal audit department, management, and the implementation owners to review the implementation progress, discuss any challenges or obstacles, and provide guidance and support as needed. In addition to the regular meetings, the internal audit department conducts follow-up audits to verify that the recommended actions have been implemented effectively and that the intended benefits have been realized. These follow-up audits provide assurance that the implemented actions are sustainable and continue to drive operational excellence. To ensure that implementation owners are held accountable, the organization has established a clear accountability framework. This framework outlines the responsibilities of each implementation owner, including the requirement to provide regular progress updates, identify and mitigate risks, and ensure that the recommended actions are implemented within the agreed-upon timeline. The accountability framework also outlines the consequences of not implementing the recommended actions, including the escalation of issues to senior management and the audit committee. This ensures that implementation owners are aware of the importance of implementing the recommendations and the implications of not doing so. Furthermore, the organization has established a recognition and reward system to encourage implementation owners to prioritize the implementation of internal audit recommendations. This system recognizes and rewards implementation owners who have successfully implemented recommendations and achieved significant benefits, including cost savings, process improvements, or enhanced controls. Overall, the organization's process for tracking and monitoring the implementation of internal audit recommendations is robust and effective. It ensures that all recommendations are properly monitored, and their implementation is effectively tracked to ensure that the intended benefits are realized. The process also holds respected departments and units accountable for their timely and effective execution, ensuring that the organization achieves operational excellence.